Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Unreal. I'm back with another gameplay commentary. Here today, got some more Black Ops 3 gameplay for you guys. This is TDM playing against the Christmas noobs. Yes. Um, if you want to play against Christmas noobs, you have to play in TDM. Like, what the- what was that kid doing? Kid had no thumbs. Like, bruh, I don't even have a scuff controller. I don't even have my buttons mapped out. Bruh. Anyway, playing on Infection. This is by far, I, this is probably my, probably my second favorite map to play on. I used to hate this map when the game first came out, but this map has really grown on me and I, I vote for it every time it pops up. I really like this map. Um, but yeah, slaying the Christmas noobs. You'll see soon in this video, I get this epic quad feed like this freaking epic quad feed i know right now the gameplay doesn't look too impressive because you know i'm dying and shit but i went like 34 and 4 it was pretty good i mean i made these kids look silly but um it's not their fault um it's definitely not their fault at all but anyway that's probably why david bondahar didn't want kill streaks to be good and i actually kind of understand why he didn't want them to be good now but, um, anyway, let's talk about the class setup, because this class is amazing. If, you, if you're looking for a gun to play, I highly recommend this gun. It's the KN94. The attachments I'm rocking with are quick draw, stock, grip, and high caliber. You're probably wondering why high caliber. That, that doesn't seem like a very good perk, because... <laughs> High caliber, all it does is um, headshots and in increase damage. That's all it really does. Um, but in this game, you do flinch a lot. Um, so a lot of times, you're able to win gunfights that you shouldn't because you get flinched up and your bullets end up hitting the enemy's head. And you get a kill, so that's really good. You will you win gunfights more with high caliber. Um, also... Um, if you hip fire, if you're jumping around and you're hip firing, a lot of times this is that quad feed I was telling you about, man. It was it was nasty. Anyway, um, lost my train of thought. Oh yeah, so a lot of times you have to hip fire. You know, I don't have I don't use gung ho or nothing. I'm not gonna put a laser sight on my assault rifle. So a lot of times you'll hip fire and your bullets will spray everywhere, and a lot of times you'll get lucky and hit the enemy in the head, and you'll get a kill off of it. So, high caliber, is, high caliber is just really good. I don't know if it's really good on other assault rifles, but it's really good on the KN. I feel like it makes the KN just more powerful. Um, I mean, I'm, you guys can see, I'm just tearing through kids. Um, but yeah, so that's it for the gun. Try it out. Put high caliber on. It makes this gun ten times better. I swear it does. Um, and as far as the perks, I got a flat jacket. Uh, toughness and tack mask. That's pretty much the standard on assault rifles. Um, I like flat jacket because when you're running around, oh, you don't have to worry about those trip mines. And because it's Christmas noob season, you're gonna run into a lot of trip mines. Like not this game, but I think two games after this one I played, I ended up running to like trip mine after trip mine after trip mine. It was ridiculous. Um, and then fast, fast hands and tack mask. See. I would have died. I would have died right there. I mean, I already, I died anyway. But I would have died to that uh, thermal heat explosion thingy. Um, thermite, whatever it's called. Look, look at that headshot too. Instant melt. But um, yeah, I would have died to that thermal fire thing. Putting that flight jacket on. Um, and then as far as my specialist, I'm using combat focus. <clears throat> Mainly, I think combat focus is just really good in general, but I was using it because I was trying to get some challenges with it. But also, it's really good in TDM because TDM, as it's been in every single Call of Duty, is a terrible game type to try to get your score streaks because there's no objectives. Um, you can only get your score streaks by getting kills. And when you get combat focus on, I mean, it's 200 per kill, so three kills is a like counting your AV. Two kills as a UAV, so it, it's really good. It, it, I like it a lot, especially in TDM. Um, I believe in this game, I get my talent and my wraith because of my combat focus. Yeah, see, I got my talent and my wraith. 
all because of my uh, combat focus. So, if you don't use a combat focus, I highly recommend it. I think it's good all around, any game type, any game mode, especially if you're playing like TDM, free for all, etc., etc. Um, and then for the kill streaks, it's using UAV because it's UAV. Um, I'm using the Talon, which I don't know how I feel about the Talon. The Talon sometimes it does wonders, and then the other times it doesn't do shit for you. So and then lastly, I was using the Wraith, and I like the Wraith; it's pretty good. But that's the gameplay. I don't know what I want. I think it was like 34 and four or 34 and five. I can't see. My screen is extremely tiny. But thank you guys for watching. Try this class setup; it's amazing. I swear it is. I mean, you will melt kids, especially the Christmas noobs. Thanks for watching. Please give this video a like if you enjoyed. Also, subscribe if you're new and you want to continue to see more content. Follow me on Twitter. Link will be in the description below. Hope you guys have a great day. My name is Unreal, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.